go wrong with some good old Nirvana. How's it going? My name's John McLennan. Thanks for hanging out with me in my studio today. Just wanted to give you a quick guitar lesson on uh, a song called Smells Like Teen Spirit by a band called Nirvana. And it's an awesome song, so let's zoom in and break it down. The intro rhythm part starts out on an F5, or an F power chord. You play it by putting your first finger on the first fret of the sixth string. Then you play the third fret of the fifth string, and put your pinky right underneath that third fret on the fourth string. So let's map out these four chords first. We're going to take this F power chord. That's the first shape. Then we're going to move it down one string. Now when I do that, my first finger comes up just enough to touch the sixth string and mute it so that I can actually strum the chord without getting the low E note ringing in there. F, B flat 5. Then you move up to the 3rd fret on the 6th string, and then you go up from there to the 4th fret. So it's just more of like what's called a passing chord. And then you do the same thing by moving down one string. So to me, it's almost like a copy paste of this with a, a little passing chord in there. All right, so that's the, those are the shapes. Now, if I talk about the right hand, I'm going to go like this. Down, up, down, OK? Down, up, down, real fast, like that. Down, up, down. Then I'm going to go, and what I'm doing there is I'm just muting the strings. And I'm going down, up, down, up. And then I do uh, two quick punches on a B flat five. Then you move from the third fret up to the fourth fret and do the same thing. Remember that you want the to be real muted in there. And then the last bit that I'm doing is I'm actually just slamming the open strings as I go from that D flat 5 back home to my F bar chord. Again, just kind of filling space with that as a sound. As you learn this song, it's really just a great study for uh, using power chords. So be sure to hit subscribe below and we'll see you in the next lesson. Thanks for watching.